Heading for the train Feeling nearly faded as my jeans Here's a song that Chris wrote, and I sang it, and I loved it, and I've been singing it so long, I've kind of claimed it all for my own, but I would really be honored if you'd sing it with me. Well, I woke up Sunday morning with no way to hold my hand. It's a song by a good friend of mine. His name is Chris Christopherson. They hear us write some nice tunes. This is called Bobby McGee. Freedom is just another word for nothing left to lose. Nothing. And that's all that Bobby left me. Guys are my heroes and my best friends, and uh, and he's got the best bus in the world. <laughs> oh, we're just glad to be here hanging out together. It wouldn't matter if it was the Grammys, the disc jockey convention. It don't matter. I'm real pleased to to be getting a, a songwriters award and uh, particularly the Johnny Mercer Award because he's such a, such a great writer. And, and there are so many writers up here that I respect. I want you and Tommy with me. What the hell do you want? Oh, David, you just don't understand. You could be happy here. Oh, sure, sure. But I'm not going to let anybody stop me this time. Who's stopping you? Chris was slightly daunted at times. But I had done a lot of things. I've worked on as a laborer in Wake Island, and I'd worked in Alaska on the railroad and firefighting, and four years of college, two years at Oxford, five years in the Army. Then four years of working to be accepted as a songwriter, a couple of years flying helicopters out in the Gulf of Mexico, and I'd been a lot of things, and I'd done a lot of things. Gonna make it. Don't look down. Come on out and see how it feels in the lights. A star is born vaulted Chris to Hollywood stardom and won him the Golden Globe Award for uh, from the foreign press's best actor and a, a major event in your lifetime. What was it like working with uh, Barbara Streisand? It was real hard and it was real rewarding. Yeah. It was like... Uh, did you know her before the film began? Yeah, I did. Yeah. I had known her uh, some years before that. We had actually uh, kind of dated or whatever. Is that right? Back, uh, now, I didn't realize that. When did that take uh, place? Uh, 